And now, your Storm Team 2 forecast with meteorologist Tara Hastings. Well, we're going to see the chance for just an isolated shower here to pop up over the next couple of hours. Temperatures will be falling back into the lower 80s. We'll hit about 80 degrees at 11 o'clock tonight. And the chance for some showers and thunderstorms will still be there. But I think the bulk of them will continue to move farther southward. As we take a look at your forecast tomorrow, can't rule an isolated shower or storm in the morning with temperatures into the 70s. We'll climb to about 83 degrees by lunchtime. And an isolated shower or storm possible into the afternoon again. It's still going to be very muggy. With highs in the mid and upper 80s. Well, we don't have any severe weather uh, threat right now here across the Miami Valley, but we do have a severe thunderstorm watch in effect just to the east of us. We'll show you on Live Doppler 2 HD our network of radars while well, the storms are to the east of us and they're to the south of us. We'll zoom in a little bit closer because we did have some pockets of heavy rain pushing through Montgomery County and also into Greene County, but those have now fallen apart here. We'll give you the wider picture. We have some clouds in parts of the Miami Valley, but then we have uh, some sunshine in the northern half as well. We're tracking a chance for some showers and thunderstorms to develop just to the south of I-70 in Indiana, and those showers and thunderstorms will continue to push southward and impact areas of southern Ohio closer towards Cincinnati. So we'll show you in our future track forecast model. Again, an isolated shower, not out of the question. A better chance for some show showers and thunderstorms developing in the southern half of the state here. Then as we go into early tomorrow morning, our southern counties may get clipped here around 7 o'clock, which is and a few light showers moving through the Butler, Warren, and Clinton counties. Outside right now, our stall vision camera have some wet pavement out there. We had a shower roll through here, parts of Greene County. Otherwise, seeing some cloud cover. Temperatures into the 80s. It's 87 degrees right now in Troy. It's 86 in Springfield, 85 in Xenia. It's 88 in Springboro. And look at Wilmington right now at 89. Officially at the airport, we're at 86. We have some breezy winds out of the west at 13 miles per hour. This is one thing we've been watching here all weekend long, the dew point value into the mid and upper 70s. At one point today, our heat index here in the Dayton area was close to 95 degrees. Right now, it still feels like those temperatures are into the lower 90s. And as we end the weekend out, we're still going to see those very oppressive dew point values here. Eventually, heading into next week, they'll begin to drop just a little bit. All right, tonight on your future track forecast model, again, an isolated shower may be possible, but a better chance for some pockets of heavier rain moving into the southern half of the Miami Valley. And then tomorrow morning, an isolated shower may be possible. Heading into the afternoon hours, we're going to see those hot and humid conditions once again, so we can't rule out a chance for some showers and thunderstorms. And some of those thunderstorms may be on the stronger side, of course, with some heavy rainfall, maybe some brief gusty winds. So the Storm Prediction Center does have us under a slight risk for some of those storms reaching severe criteria. So we'll continue to keep an eye on it for you here. D uh, tonight, down to about 73 degrees. Cloudy, muggy with an isolated shower or storm possible. Up to 88 degrees tomorrow. Again, very humid once again with some scattered showers and thunderstorms. In your Storm Team 2 seven-day forecast on Monday and Tuesday, we begin to see those humidity values drop a little bit. It's still going to be uncomfortable at times, but not as oppressive as what we've been seeing over the last couple of days. 85 on Monday with some sunshine. Tuesday, sunny skies as well. And then as we go into Wednesday, we'll see temperatures into the mid and upper 80s with a chance for a few showers or storms holding off until Thursday. But whoo, 